This photo of a happy family may not be all that it seems, as we learn disturbing new details in the arrest of a Colorado dentist and father of six, Dr. James Craig, who police say poisoned and murdered his wife, Angela. My name is Dr. Jim Craig, and I practice at Summerbrook Dental Group. Police allege Craig laced his wife's protein shakes with potassium cyanide and arsenic which led to her death on Saturday and Craig's arrest the next day. According to a newly released 52-page arrest affidavit, police say they found a troubling search history on Craig's computer, including the top five undetectable poisons that show no signs of foul play and is arsenic detectable in autopsy. According to the affidavit, Craig also ordered both arsenic and potassium cyanide online and had them delivered to his dental practice. Legal experts say that could be damning. The toxicology results will be critical. You have the defendant in possession of cyanide. As long as you can link that up to the death, then you're going to have a strong case. Angela Craig's sister, Tony Kofi, telling police there may have been marital issues between the couple, calling their relationship tumultuous and accusing him of having multiple affairs. Detectives believe James Craig was hoping to start a new life with a woman from Texas and say he was actually flying that woman to Colorado while his wife was dying in the hospital. If there was an extramarital affair, that's not necessarily evidence that the defendant killed his wife, but it certainly could be evidence of motive to kill his wife. According to the affidavit, just days before her death, Angela Craig complained of dizziness and nausea, texting her husband, I feel drugged. His response, given our history, I know that must be triggering. Just for the record, I didn't drug you. According to that arrest record, Angela's sister, Tony, also told police James had actually drugged his wife once before about five or six years ago. Police believe what James is referring to in that troubling text message exchange there. James is being charged with first degree murder and has not entered a plea. We've reached out to his attorney, but have not yet heard back. Craig. Mm. Wow. All right. Uh, Miguel Amelgar for us. Miguel, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.